What's going on everybody? I'm Grim Repair. Welcome to the channel. Today we're working on a Ford Transit and we have a door that makes a lot of noise when you open or close it. And we're going to replace the door check assembly. Tools you're going to need for this job are a small flathead, a T, uh, a T20 and a T25 Torx bit, a 7 millimeter ratchet and a 10 millimeter ratchet. First thing we're gonna do is go around and find all of these covers and we're going to pop them off so we can get to the bolts underneath. There's one down in here inside the grab handle. There's one here. And this light here also has a screw behind it. Then there's two screws underneath the door and there's another one of these covers in here in the bottom section right there oh and you also have a plastic cover here behind the handle just gonna take the small flat head and pry at it here at the back next we're gonna take a seven millimeter and loosen these up That one's a T25 down in the handle there. And inside there is a T20. All right, now the door panel is going to lift off. We're going to have some wiring holding it in still, so be careful of that. And we also have the cable that goes to the handle here. We're just gonna grab this tab right here and pull it toward us, and then that'll release. And here's the wiring that I was talking about. The release tab is toward the inside of the door, or toward the outside of the door panel inside of the van. And then on this front connector, it's on the outside inside of the door panel toward the door and we got another one here toward the inside all right now that we got the door panel off we're gonna gently peel down this plastic cover here now we're gonna take a 10 millimeter socket these two in here are also 10 millimeters slides out and take the new one slide it back in these work on left hand or right hand left hand right hand it says it right here on the arm just gonna slide it back in same way it came out Don't tighten them all the way up until they're all have been started. All right, now we can push that plastic cover back where it was. And if you do need to pop these out, these auto body uh, clip removal tools work good. There'll be a link down below for that tool if you need it. So. All right, now we're just gonna plug it back in. Hmm, that was weird. And then this here, just gonna slide back in there just pops into place you want to make sure you get this lock rod in the hole here before you lower the panel down all right 
sort of get long. Make sure you get the panel back in that groove that it goes in on the weather stripping up here. Put these seven millimeter screws back in. Put the T25 screw back into the handle. Pop the cover back in. Don't forget about the one behind the reflector here. Make sure you don't drop it. You need to tape it onto your socket, that might help. Pop that cover back on. Pop that cover back on. And that's it. High five. You did it. Thanks for watching.